we want to make the yummiest, most irresistible strawberry jam in the world, we have to begin at the root literally. Because behind every spoonful of jam lies a world of science, precision farming, and robotic innovation working together. To grow the perfect fruit, it starts with the soil, not just any soil, but fluffy, nutrient-rich earth balanced with minerals and moisture to help young strawberry plants thrive. These aren't simple garden pots. They're industrial containers, monitored by technology to ensure ideal growing conditions. Robots begin the process by planting tiny strawberry seedlings into pouches or containers, pot by pot. Then comes the perfect amount of water, carefully calibrated to keep each plant hydrated and happy. Over time, in a climate-controlled environment, with ideal lighting and care, these strawberry plants flourish and bear fruit plump, juicy and brilliantly red. When harvest time arrives, an impressive fleet of robotic arms springs into action. With delicate precision, they grip each ripe strawberry by the stem and gently snip it off, leaving the fruit completely intact and unbruised. The berries are then sorted by weight and quality. Even in a high-tech world, human hands step in to inspect the fruits, ensuring only the finest strawberries move forward. Then, the green leafy tops called hulls are neatly removed by intelligent machines designed to detect and slice just the hull without damaging the fruit. After dehulling, the berries enter a two-stage cleaning process. The first wash, using water and gentle vibrations, removes dirt, sand, and tiny insects. The second bath involves food-safe sanitizers like chlorine dioxide, ensuring the fruit is squeaky clean and free from pesticides and bacteria. Clean, fresh, and glowing, the strawberries are now ready for their final transformation. Some strawberries are preserved by freezing. They're packed in food-grade containers and sealed to lock in the freshness, destined for smoothies and desserts. But others go on to fulfill their higher calling jam. The frozen strawberries are thawed and transferred into large carriers where their transformation begins. Sugar is added in precise amounts to bring out the natural sweetness, and the mixture is carefully monitored via control panels that adjust temperature and mixing speed. This berry sugar blend is then bathed in hot water, forming a syrupy base. What follows is mesmerizing. The entire mixture passes through fine sieves to remove pulp and seeds, leaving behind a silky smooth strawberry based dot to give the jam its jelly-like consistency. A plant-based thickening agent called pectin is added. This natural substance helps the mixture achieve that iconic jam texture. Everything is stirred and cooked in massive kettles to let the flavors deepen and the consistency settle. Once the mixture reaches the perfect texture, a sample is tested. If it jiggles just right and coats the spoon with a glossy sheen, it's ready. The jam is then slightly cooled, allowing the flavors to settle and blend even further, ensuring every bite is smooth and delicious. Now comes the truly satisfying part, the jarring process. Clean, empty glass jars line up on conveyors like dancers waiting for their cue. With no human hands required, a precisely portioned stream of jam is poured into each jar. Lids are automatically sorted, placed, and twisted shut to create an airtight seal. That delightful pop you hear when you open a fresh jar? That's from this very moment. Once sealed, the jars go through a quick rinse to remove any stickiness, and then head to the labeling station. Each label contains all the vital information, brand name, nutrition facts, ingredients so you know exactly what you're enjoying, and it doesn't stop with full-size jars. Many of these batches are packaged into those familiar mini jam packets you find in cafes and airplanes. Those tiny sugar-packed portions bursting with fruity flavor. Small in size but just as carefully made, these packets help reduce food waste and provide the perfect serving every time. Once labeled, all the jam big and small is boxed, stacked, and shipped out to stores, restaurants, and eventually, 
Your kitchen shelf thawed at long last, the jam is ready to meet its lifelong partner. Bread. And if you're curious how that fluffy golden loaf is made, well, that's another behind the scenes journey waiting to unfold. But for now, enjoy your toast, topped with the jam that took a symphony of sides, robots and nature to create from soil to spoon, one strawberry at a time. This man may just have the most oddly satisfying job in the world. All he has to do is spread cocoa beans evenly onto a conveyor elevator. It sounds simple, but this step is crucial. The beans must be laid flat to travel smoothly toward the separator chambers, where machines begin their magical transformation. First, the outer shells are carefully removed to reveal the cocoa nibs, the tiny, flavor-packed cores of the beans. Bees nibs then enter the grinding phase, where industrial grinders crush every last bit into a velvety paste. The texture becomes smooth, the aroma rich, and soon the paste is melted down into what can only be described as liquid gold. This melted chocolate is then filtered through ultra-fine sieves, ensuring a lump-free, glossy finish that's creamy, silky, and absolutely divine. Once ready, the chocolate is poured into custom design molds to create those perfectly circular chocolate discs, the foundation of Smarties. Each mold is filled with precision, creating uniform rounds that are then sent into a chilling chamber. Here, cold air locks in the flavor and solidifies the chocolate while preserving the perfect texture and snap. As these molds exit the cooling tunnel, rollers and belts gently release the Smarties, separating them without damaging their delicate form. From here, the process turns vibrant and even more exciting. The chocolate beans are tumbled into color-specific. Coating drums, each drum designated for a different Smarties hue, from classic brown to vibrant yellow, green, pink, and red. If you've ever picked your favorite color from a pack, now, you know, they each come from their own little house. The candy coating is a sweet mix of sugar, coloring agents, and natural flavorings like orange, grape, cherry, pineapple, lemon, and strawberry. These are applied in layers, coating each chocolate center in a protective shell that's crunchy on the outside and keeps the soft decor intact. Once fully coated, the Smarties head into massive polishing drums where a blend of cocoa butter, sugar, milk powder, and flour is added, giving each bean that shiny, irresistible finish and satisfying crunch. But they're not ready yet before. They can be packaged, they must pass the Sing Deck, the final test in quality control. Only Smarties that meet the standard's perfect shape, flawless coating, no cracks, make it through. The rest are sent back to be reprocessed. This high standard ensures consistency and excellence in every single bite. What's even more impressive is that both Smarties factories Combined produce up to 70,000 to 80,000 pounds of chocolate beans per day. Just two facilities powering a global favorite. As we move into packaging, the process becomes a dance of precision. Mini Smarties packs are filled by high-speed machines, 500 grams, 250 grams, and snack size formats all automatically measured and sealed. Then comes the iconic tube filling stage. Robotic arms drop exact portions of Smarties into the tubes, seal them instantly, and move them down the line without skipping a beat. Except tubes are arranged, counted, labeled, and boxed with precision. Every movement is pre-programmed, every step machine-guided, ensuring there's no error from filling to sealing to shipping. Finally, these colorful packs of joy are sent around the world ready to satisfy cravings and create smiles in every corner of the globe. Time you open a pack of Smarties and savor that sweet crunch, remember, you're not just tasting chocolate. You're experiencing a process that blends science, flavor, precision, and joy in every single... If you enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more updates. Share your thoughts in the comment section down below.